I guess I'll just jump right into it. I'm starting over. Um, on normal this time, though, because classic is not good for me at all. So I'm doing normal, and also I've got a game, like a tutorial game thing going on, because I didn't realize the tutorial is actually not really a tutorial. It's actually just a... Uh, I'm a guy who's going to tell you things every now and again and not actually teach you anything about the game type thing. So it just kind of goes on f pretty much ever as far as I can tell. And I've made it through like nine missions now, haven't lost anybody, did a base, didn't lose anybody, so... A normal Iron Man. Should be good. I'm just going to start the list over from the top though, because I don't really know where I left off. This operation will be in Canada. I know I had one person who actually survived, like, every time through the overwhelming odds. I think it was Rotafiri. Um, managed to survive the entire time. Ended up retreating, like, three missions. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how this goes. Where the heck are we this time? Where has it put me? Alright. Basically, the tactic that I was doing was just, um, I would use the, uh, the assault guys, the ones that can, that can, like, move a lot and still shoot. I would basically just have them move up a bit and try to piss something off, and then when they did, they would just fall back and, uh, overwatch and just try to draw the aliens toward us. I went for, uh, for the, the weapons early on. The weapons were one of the first things I got. And that seemed to work out okay, because then you can kill most aliens with, like, one hit. For the most part. Not chrysalids, though, unless you crit them. Chrysalids are icky. They look weird, too. I don't I don't know if I like it or not. Um, I also, like, never used grenades at all. They are really not good, at least these grenades. I don't know what kind of grenades you can get later on. But, um... The grenades that the game gives you at the start are awful. They're not good at all. Try to get everybody up enough so they can do overwatch. And if they can't do overwatch, then just try to get them out of position so they can't be shot at. Yes, 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 you hear the two sectoids, was it? Yeah, that guy. I think there's a second one. Their weapons appear to self-destruct when the operator dies. We should look closely for any fragments that could be salvaged for our own development programs. Right. Nobody's really... Oh, yeah, okay, you can see him. Yeah, there's no way in hell you're hitting him, but you can see him. Yeah, it broke the glass, though. Alright, so if we move... God, where can we move so he doesn't have a chance to shoot us? There's really nowhere. Oh, I guess back back over here will work just fine. Unless he moves. Which he probably will. So we'll go even further back? Hmm. Where can you go? Oh, and just to clarify earlier um, about feedback, it's not that I don't appreciate feedback, it's just there's a lot of people out there being assholes about it for really no good reason. And we'll hope that the uh, alien will move into position and we can take advantage of uh, Overwatch with that. I don't know if these people are close enough or not. But I can't really move him up to the wall yet. So we'll see. He's just gonna fall back, that's fine. That gives me opportunity to step it up. Close the gap. There's probably another group of them somewhere back there. Hang out by the soft drinks over here. 60% chance of critting. Fortunately, you just completely missed. I 
I don't know if he's got an angle or not to shoot me from there. It's hard telling. It's so hard to tell. Just dash through the window. And you... Replace her. a grenade and try to kill him or at least get rid of all the cover. Or just startle the fuck out of him. Cause I don't think we uh, I don't think we got him there. I'm thinking there's people back there. I just saw that alleyway over there too, and I was thinking, man, I'm I'm betting there's some over there. I didn't realize the map was so big that way. I thought it was just straightforward. And I think that's the guy from inside. So all three of them are right over there then. Which Kinda works for me. Can't get a grenade all the way over there yet. Guess our best bet is just to take shots at him then. Up from where? So this is one of those times I don't know if I should just uh, fall back a bit in Overwatch or try to move up and kill him. I never know. I'm just gonna fall back and use Overwatch. see what happens. Whoa! I think a vehicle exploded back there. Jeez. I wish I could like move the camera while it's doing this. Just sitting here staring. It's a nice floor. It's actually kind of a nice shop thing, place. Especially like the display blocking the product. We do that uh, where I work too. It's fantastic. It's so nice to uh to stock items when there's just a giant display right there in the way. It's, it's awesome. I love it. We'll overwatch another turn. The wall's just continuously breaking apart. I think there may be the vending machines blowing up from fire or something. I don't know. For the time being, it seems like we're just hearing them a lot. We're not actually seeing them. I think the aliens are waiting for us as well. I hear them doing that mind merge thing, though. There we go. One finally stepping up. And it looks like we hit him. And there's another one right outside saying hi. Alright, let's break his cover and kill him. Hoorah. Oh, actually it didn't improve my accuracy at all. I didn't break the wall that he was hiding behind. Broke everything else, though. Um, you've already shot, so you're just going to get shot at if I don't do anything. Um, this is a really crappy place to be holding out. I don't know if I can see him from here or not. No. Too much crap in the way. Do 
don't think we'll hit him. Oh, we do, and we kill him. All right, well, that was lucky. I think there's just the one more then. There he is. And nobody can see him. Lucky, uh, the labs are lucky rolls Teams are standing by in my favor this time. Begin researching the newly recovered I remember before, 45% chance, 30%, 25%, forget about it. It's like unless it's 90% or 100%, just don't even try, you'll fail. Ah. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. Impressive Thank you. Work, Commander. Our soldiers have okay, to be we got a sniper. And sport. Not horrible. I wish I had a heavy right off the bat or an assault, but that's okay. Close combat situations. Just like it sounds. The so Weapon fragments right off the bat. I agree. That does. Hello, engineering. Manufacturer. Hey, med kit. We still got some room to grow up here, but if we really want to expand our facilities, we're going to have to start excavating beneath the base. Unfortunately, the deeper we go, the more it's going to cost. Start expanding early. Try to get um, a bunch of labs set operation. up in uh, in a line. Try to get some fast research going on. Can't use my situation room yet. Okay. Well, sniper. Do 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 do. First sniper. Commander to mission control. Commander to mission. I don't control. wanna. I don't wanna go to mission control. Rota Fury is a sniper this time around. And for support. It's apparently <laughs> Draven. Going with Mr. Draven again because that's what I did last time, but you're a chick this time, so. Enjoy that, I guess. Uh, can't really. Commander to mission control. Would you rather I gave you a male so I could actually give you the facial hair? Because I, I don't think I can do the facial hair here at all. Yes, I could just make a really weird looking chick. Hmm. Go with that for now. Let me know. Then research your working on fragments, that's fine. Mission control, what do you want? Oh, you just want me to scan. Whatever. Commander, we've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Uh, engineers or scientists. Hmm. Scientists. God, a lot of chicks. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing, but my god. Medkit. And medkit. Draven, you can hang on to your frag grenade just in case you need to blow somebody out of cover. Other than that, though, I guess that's uh, it's all we can do. Dropship has arrived. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. I don't think I've done this map either. I did one similar to this, though. 
Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Okay. Step up in Overwatch. We'll have the sniper hang back for now. Get everybody else up there. In case we do run into trouble, I'll use a smoke grenade and try to save a life. If at all possible. I guess I'll get you cover to start with. Switch to the pistol so you can use Overwatch. And we don't really need a smoke grenade quite yet, apparently, because we don't know where anything is. So we'll just have you move up and Overwatch. There's probably no alien patrols. No, nothing. Step up again. Nothing here. Nothing here. It's a very quiet start. Okay, that's the edge of map there. That's the edge there. Okay, so this one really is just the street type thing. Okay. Just keep moving up slowly until we find something. I am not going to get the high ground because that just, that just oozes death if you do that. It's horrible. And overwatch. Seems like whenever I get the high ground, I'm always put in a situation that I can't possibly defend myself in. Good stuff. Hmm? Okay, they're way back there then. Past the port of bodies. Positive enemy contacts. There they are. I guess you could have gone in the van, couldn't you? Oh well. Too late now. Overwatch. And... Um, let's hide back there and drop a... Smoke grenade right there. Cover the three of us. I'm assuming the aliens will step up, we'll take fire at them with overwatch, I'm assuming we'll probably miss, and the aliens will take fire on us, but the smoke should help our defenses enough. Or the aliens will just sit there and do absolutely nothing, that works too, we'll wait for them. I'll have you move up and take out the pistol and use overwatch that way. Get me. What was that sound? Come on. Here we got one. I don't know where. Oh, okay. Shot failed to connect. Uh, that is not good. It sucks with health scopes. It really sucks. Nobody can hit. And of course they take the reaction fire as soon as they possibly can, no matter how far away the alien is. Or something that I was noticing is they would send out, like, the most injured alien first, so everybody takes the reaction fire on it, and then they send out the healthier one. Super annoying like that. I'll shoot the one in back since nobody else is really going to have a shot at him. Damn it. Enemy is still alive. Missed. Fair enough. Uh, sniper. Go for the headshot. Pretty good chance of killing him. Got him. And we've got... Just the one way over there. 
up into this and just overwatch in case something tries to flank us. In case the aliens try to do something fancy. And like that. Looks like they're gonna hang back though. That's fine. They're way over there. Oof, got him. Alright, so there's just the two in the far corner now. That's probably the last group of them, I think. These early missions seem to only have uh, a couple groups of aliens. Get on this side of the cover. Oh, Jesus, there's a third group. They're back on the bus, and they're doing a mine merge thing up there. Super. Alright, fall back. I guess just behind the barrels again. Through the porta potties. Got him. Dead and gone. Oh. We're alone out here. And Sniper decides to shoot as well. Um, good job, Sniper. I think that's Rotafury. <laughs> no, okay. Wait, yes. Yes, Rotafury. Alright, Overwatch. Overwatch. Over here, Overwatch, and Overwatch. This is what the beginning of the game mostly consisted of for me, personally. Just go up there, draw them out, fall back, set up like a Overwatch firing squad, in a way. After a little while, you can get the scopes in and everybody's fairly accurate enough that you can gun stuff down as it comes to you. Or at least injured enough to finish it off with a grenade or a free aim rocket or something. Uh, okay, you can see him. You can see him too. Two shots, I'll take them. Only needed one though. Weapons empty. Can't engage. Overwatch, 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 everybody's low on ammo. Gonna need to take care of that at some point. Just keep Overwatching. You're forced to reload. I think if nothing happens here, I'll step up again. Just work that? my way up to the next line of cover. There's that mine merge going on way up there. I think they are on the move then. Step it out. There we go, we see him. You see too. And you don't see any. Great. Please hit and please kill. That'd be great. Missed. Damn it! No rounds. All right, so you're out of ammo now. You're kind of forced to just Overwatch, but I don't. Think Think you'll actually get a shot off. I guess we'll just have you dash up and use you eventually next turn. 50%. I don't think you can get a grenade way over there. No. 
This is a time when I wish I had a heavy. The free aim rocket, right into that truck. Luckily we took him down. Nice, and I think that's it? That's it, okay. Yeah, the free aim rocket is so clutch, it's like a guaranteed kill for the weaker aliens. It's a shame you only get one rocket though. Or like the shredder rocket, I'm a fan of that, plus 33% damage, it's amazing for the sniper. Oh, so good. Hey, we got our heavy, nice. Congratulations, Horst, you are, you are a female as well. You got... They've been promoted already. They're the first ones into a fight, and the last ones out. Covering fire is usually what I go with here. This three extra tiles is nice, but... Oh man, covering fire. So when they shoot, you can do reaction fire as well. That's just... That's good, so then you don't gotta worry about it. They can stay there and shoot at you, and it doesn't even matter. Commander, There's to the, the lab. situation room. Commander, we will be in touch, Commander. So I can build that now, then? I think the answer is yes. Uh, let's just check real quick. Yes, yes I can. Okay. Build buy items. Commander, I will get a uh, current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite yeah, whatever. deployments. I'll, I'll get around to it. It'll take you 20 days to build that anyway, so don't worry about it. You guys are working on that. That's fine. Barrack soldiers, we've got our heavy. Are they studying us? Why abduct humans seemingly at random? There must be a pattern that we haven't established yet. Mm. I think that's spelled right. <laughs> Stormtrooper white with helmet. Whoops. Helmet, helmet, helmet. Um, I guess that's the closest Stormtrooper helmet you can get. Armored Deco, there we go. Where's that white at? There we go. I guess that's a stormtrooper. I think that might be the closest I can Commander get. I don't know. The other helmets are kind of not at all. You got Master Chief, something, and then that. And then an assault. Already got Draven. Commander to um, the situation room. Commander to the situation room. The people who don't really have a preference as far as like class goes or rank and all that, I'm just going to uh, kind of put you toward the bottom of the list because I'm going to have a lot of like extra snipers and I'm not going to be bringing four snipers on a mission or anything like that. Like, I'm going to have a lot of duplicate classes here that I'm not going to be using every mission, Commander so I'll kind of have two situation. squads going. Commander to the hey, what am I doing? I don't have the new armor yet. We've got Is that how I did it? I think that's how I did it before. Commander to the situation room. Yeah, I I will hold on. One second there, situation room. Alright. Training school, I can't do that yet. Nobody's high enough. Every member what? of the council is going to want satellite coverage. So we should plan our deployments carefully. Yeah, I got it. I can't launch a satellite yet, though, can I? Oh, I can. Well, then. If I can, well, let's launch it in Canada, then. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum there we go. Capacity. Additional uplink required. Okay, so now we're building the third satellite, and I will build a satellite uplink at some point. <laughs> we'll go to the gray market and sell off some of our extra sectoid corpses. Some of the artifacts we've recovered. There we go. We should be careful in choosing what items we release. And we'll wait until the stuff finishes up. 